Good morning and welcome to day 29. Guys, uh, I'm about three miles into a 16 and a half mile day. Uh, last night was crazy, crazy cold. The temperature in Irwin was 22 degrees, felt like 14. I'm not sure what Irwin's elevation is, but we were at 5,000 feet last night. Everything was frozen. My bottles of water are frozen. I even turned them upside down thinking we might get a little ice. No, they are freaking frozen. The wind blew into the shelter all night. Thank God I had a zero degree quilt and all my clothes on that were dry because of course it rained all day yesterday. Well, we're gonna have days like that out here. Now I'm heading to Irwin. Slippers go pick me up. We're gonna go into Johnson City and eat like we haven't ate in days. Um, and then we'll see. I may take a zero just to recover from this last leg, or I may get back on the trail. I haven't decided yet. We'll figure that out later. Well guys, I need to apologize. I've been kind of slacking this morning, but with as cold as it is, my photographer was on um, protest and was not willing to function this morning. But here's a view I have. See the mountains back there? Hopefully there'll be plenty more like it as we get into Irwin. All right, guys, I thought I'd give you another episode of As the Trail Turns. Um, by Brought to you by Rocket Man. And just share a little bit of the trail with you. Let you see what I'm seeing. I was told that... The last big climb has been completed. So hopefully if that goes true, the next eight plus miles will um, be a little easier. It's hard to believe how cold it was this morning And how nice it is now. And I don't know, it may, it may be only 40 degrees. But I guess when you go from the teens with wind chills, had to be in the single digits. Freezing hands, freezing feet, frozen shoes, frozen clothes. Um, 40 is like amazing. So, again, this is what I'm looking at. As you can see, we got a beautiful blue sky. Haven't seen that in like three days. Uh, you may think trail magic and things like that make a hiker's day. I'll tell you what really makes my day is when that big orange sphere shows its beautiful face and gives me a blur pretty blue sky and amazing hiking weather. That is what makes my day. Don't get me wrong, I love me some trail magic. Uh, not of a lot of it out 
this time of year. Uh, only had it a couple of times, but hey, it is what it is. Makes you appreciate it even more when you get it. Um, all right, I don't know if I told you earlier, but uh, I'm heading to Uncle Johnny's Hostel, where I will be picked up. And now we're going to Johnson City. I'm not sure if I have any more videos in the queue. Uh, I know I'm at least four behind today being the fourth. I have not had the ability to upload anything in the last four days, so. All right. And here we go. All right, so as to not totally bore you guys with the As the Trail Turns episode, I'm gonna cut it off here. Hey guys, we made it up to the no business shelter. Um, it's actually a pretty nice shelter for being a cinder block shelter. First one I've seen like that. There's the sign. The memory of Arnold W. Berry, 1950-2014, lifelong resident of Irwin. First to achieve 1,000 volunteer hours, proudly maintaining Hike 33, Spivey Gap to No Business Knob Shelter, Appalachian Trail. Well, thank you, Arnold Barry. We appreciate all you've done. And then they got a graffiti board, which, wow, doesn't have much graffiti. Check that out. All right, pressing on. Got about 5.7 more miles to get to Uncle Johnny's. So we'll see you there if we don't see you sooner. Hey guys, here's the Nola Chucky River. And it's looking into Irwin in the background. There's a bridge right there. Well guys, this is going to be the closeout video. Um, did 16.8 miles, I think, today. I uh, had some good views. Uh, it was a good hike. Beautiful weather. Sun shining. Uh, it started out crazy cold. But now I'm sitting in a laundromat doing my laundry in Johnson City, Tennessee. So I'll get this videos up and loaded and set your way. I hope everybody had a great day, and I will see you tomorrow.